Hello viewers, in this tutorial I will show you how to create a hand writing effect in Adobe CS 5.5. Create a new project and you'll be given a default layer. You can rename it or leave the layer just as it is. I'm going to name my background. When you are done, create another layer and give it an appropriate name. I will name my text because this is where I'll write the text on. Make sure to put the background layer below the text. So drag and drop it down. When you are done, find the rectangle tool on your tools panel, click on that, choose appropriate color, and then you draw a rectangle to cover the workspace. When you are done, extend the um, the work the timeline to the length you want this movie to last. Then you highlight the text layer. You pick your text tool. Go to the properties tab and you make your settings. I will choose the font family as as this. Then choose the star. When you are done, you click once inside the, um, the workspace and you write, you type. When you are done typing, you can change the color of the text. When this happens, click on the layer and on the object, then choose the color. I've chosen white. Okay, so when you are done, you right click on the object and convert it to bitmap, bitmap image. Now you can resize the, the, the text and then you space, space it. Okay, so we are done. Now, right click on the image again, the text again, and then break it apart. Right click and then choose break apart. Okay. Now we are going to drag this keyframe to the middle, somewhere in the middle, so that it doesn't start immediately the video you play. Okay. When you are done, choose the eraser tool and then choose the appropriate size. I will choose this. Okay. Now what we are going to do is that at you create key keyframes and at each keyframe you delete a part of of the text. So insert keyframe. Make sure that the eraser tool is start selected. We are going to lock the background so that we don't delete it as well. So click on lock to lock the background. Now, at every keyframe, you delete a portion of the test, starting from the right-hand side. You insert a keyframe, then you delete. You can use F6 on your keyboard to insert the keyframes. So, this is how it works. Insert a keyframe and delete a portion of the text, starting from your right hand side. You can zoom it to have a very better view of the workspace. So I'm going to fast forward this movie to make it fast. I believe you can do the rest. 
you follow suit. Okay, so when we are done, we have something like this. But you can see that it's starting from the left hand side. It's starting from the right to the left, but we want to start from the left to the right. So you extend the keyframe, the, the frames. Now, to make it start from the left to right, select the whole uh, frames, keyframes on the timeline, uh, and then right click, and then choose reverse frames. You highlight, select, right click, and reverse frames, and then you have something like this. You have a nice handwriting effect. Now, when the keyframes push to the right, highlight and drag it to the middle. Okay, so this is what we get. Now, go to File, Export export movie and then give it the the project and name the movie a name and the location where you want to save it I'll save my on my desktop and now let's view it and yes you have something like this hope you play around it to get a better smooth writing effect thanks for watching and subscribe to this channel for more interesting tutorials